Golightly Education Center is a very unique place where children uh, find their dreams to come true here. Um, one of the things that's very important for children to understand, as well as parents, is that we have success stories here at this school, which is pretty unique in that when the children come here, they find themselves finding out what their goals, dreams, and aspirations are because we help them to be creative in selecting that in, in, through their own choice. One of the things um, that the parents have done is they have sought this school out as an application school because they have scholars that are very high achievers. I'm in the honors class, so this is a jacket like this shows this it shows the the things that you accomplish. This jacket represents our school and so it kinda kinda represents success. And so we have different programs that kind of bring that out. We have accelerated reading classes here at our school. We have an honors program where the children um, have wonderful jackets that demonstrate their expertise in terms of being able to be the doctors, ink group that we have. Just to wear the jacket is a, just a compliment. We have um, a scholarship program here, which is our National Beta Club, as well as we have the National Honor Society here at the school. And so children who have um, a higher grade point average are selected to go into the honors program. And in addition to following the curriculum that is put forth through DPS, um, each teacher that has an honors class is tasked with adding to the curriculum things that would be challenging to not only that class but also the students individually. And so when the parents find out about all those different programs, they say that this is a place that we want to bring our child to. So once the child gets here, they're able to discover all their unique talents and abilities. For example, we have some sports students here that love playing golf. They love playing basketball, they love volleyball, and I want everybody to know that we have some wonderful volleyball and basketball and football champs here at Go Lightly Education Center. So getting back to the academic scholars, a lot of those students find themselves um, going to some of our schools like Ben Carson, and when they get there, they find themselves becoming that doctor that they never thought that they could become later on in life. And so we have partners here at our school that help to support their initiatives, such as attorneys, um, with our Doctors Inc. group, which is a group that I founded this year. The, those students, there were 20 of them who were awarded um, free laptops which is a very unique experience. And with that laptop, the students are very well able to write research papers. The whole idea is for them to be able to do a mini dissertation. They may do a lot of writing uh, with taking of notes, note-taking strategies, oral note-taking strategies. Everybody in my class loves the way I write. So I find that um, one of the things that caused me to uh, be inspired by developing that program is that they would ask me questions like, well, are you a real doctor? Um, how did you become a doctor? Because a lot of times our students, because they don't know, they associate being with the title doctor as being a, a physician. But instead of being a physician, I help them to understand that in all fields of our workplace, we can become a doctor, and that's through getting a doctorate education through a university or a college. And so I obtained mine through Wayne State, which is one of our partners. Wayne State University uh, has been a longtime partner of Go Lightly Education Center, and they've brought even some more initiatives to help and support our staff here at the school through professional development. They come in once a month um, to our staff meetings, and so our teachers are supported, our community is supported, our students are supported. What makes Go Lightly special is the commitment of the staff that's here from uh, our administrators all the way to um, kids who, uh, people who work with the kids hourly, like the teachers, the assistant, teaching assistants, also um, custodial staff, as well as lunchroom and anybody else that I'm leaving out. It's more of a family committed environment where everybody, no matter what their role or goal, uh, role is rather, in the school, the goal is still the same. Uh, Dr. Hobbs really cares about the kids and she carries it on her sleeve too. 
<laughs> but she does it in a professional way, in a loving way. She empathizes with the kids. Uh, she cries with them, she shares with them. She's stern though, and she's, she's well respected. They know when she needs, when she tells them to do something, they're expected to do it. She has high expectations. So when the question comes, why would parents want to bring their child here? My question goes back, why wouldn't you want to bring your child to go lightly education center? 